Tenants never physically see the checks from our Florida, right? They go to the landlord. So Misty Swift, though, can see that her check was processed. Yeah, her landlord was saying they never received it. Now, since that all started a few months ago, her rental homes have now been switched to a different owner, and now this issue is continuing. I've contacted people, I've emailed, I've called, I've emailed, <laughs> I've called, um, I've sent documentation in that they requested. Um, they just keep telling me a supervisor will call me back, they're on lunch or they're in a meeting and they've been on lunch and in a meeting for two months now. So. Misty Swift asked for her face not to be shown for this story. Her and several other people living in these rental homes on the west side rely on our Florida payments to keep a roof over their head. As someone is lying, I have the return um, receipt where someone from Main Street signed for the check um, on April 22nd. Uh -huh. um, they sold our property on April 21st. Swift was told her former landlords, Main Street Renewal, never got the payment. Now it's in the new owner's hands. She says they're trying to help, but no one knows where the money is. What's what's really sad about many of these situations is in many of them, there's not even a bad guy. It's just somebody sold the property. Somebody's not, you know, picked up the slack. James Tyre is an attorney with the housing defense team at Jacksonville Area Legal Aid. There could just be a miscommunication about, you know, about where the money's supposed to go and who owes what. Um, many of the property managers, when they get a new property, they just look over the ledger, see what's owed, and that's all they know, really. I reached out to her former landlords, no response. However, since I've connected her with Jacksonville Area Legal Aid, we do have an update as of last night. I am told that the former landlords are now working with the current landlords to find her Our Florida money. Now, if you are going through anything like this, any issues with Our Florida, reach out to Jala. Leah Shields, First Coast News, on your side. Yeah, Leah, thanks.